At that advisory, many people continued with their Sunday plans today. Lex Ashwell continues our team coverage live in Greene County with the conditions there. Lexa, what are you seeing? Well, Holly, it's definitely windy here in Beaver Creek. Certainly not a day to forget your gloves. Again, Greene County is one of the counties under a wind advisory. And behind me is actually a look at the Greene County uh, shopping area. Many people came out here to uh, grab a bite to eat and, and shop around. And we caught up with several folks as they were making their way around, all bundled up in their hooded coats, hats, and gloves. Many told us the stores were actually blocking the strong winds. But you can tell just how swiftly the wind is actually moving through here when you look Look towards the sky at the flags whipping on the flagpoles and tree limbs swaying back and forth. It's been very windy and cold out here, but it doesn't keep us inside. <laughs> we need to get outside. It's been so bad out, so but we're happy it's not snowing. Very windy and cold. It's about a 30-minute drive down here, and you could feel it moving the car around a little bit because we're in a big truck, so it's definitely catching the wind. And what that man just said was a very important point. Many people have been talking about how strong the winds are when they are driving, especially on the highways. It's especially important for drivers of large trucks and SUVs to be cautious of this. The wind can be hazardous. Reporting live in Beaver Creek, Alexa Ashwell, 2 News.